Well, I'm just so, just really excited about what we do. You know, we do 18th century American music. What is universal? What's something that touches people throughout culture and generations throughout time is music. When we recreate something from hundreds of years ago, we have a lot of challenges because people didn't notate everything in the complex, nuanced way that often music is notated in. There was no recording devices. No recording devices, and there was a great deal of spontaneity, like in jazz. You need musicians who understand the elements of improvisation, um, the sense of warmth and spontaneity and nuance that you can give to music, even though it's not written. It comes to life for modern audiences. So it's really exciting doing music uh, from this period, and especially American music, which is not often done. So and who are you and what are you about? What am I about and who am I? My name is Jonathan Dobin, and I'm the director of a music group called Muse Early Music Chamber Ensemble, based in Newburgh, that does 18th century vocal, instrumental, and dance music in every performance. We're trying to raise $3,500 to help pay for the musicians and dancers for our upcoming two performances of our program, Be Glad Than America. Some of the most gifted orchestra and solo players and soloist singers in the Hudson Valley area. Billings, uh, a phenomenal native-born, uh, self-taught musician. first lyric stage representation of Pocahontas in America, and they're from uh, an operetta called La Belle Sauvage, or The Indian Princess. We do one of the 18th century's most notable anti-slavery songs, The Negro Boy, which decries the cruelties of slavery. We do work by Pierre Landrin Duport, a French emigre dancing master who resided in New Jersey. We do martial music by Timothy Olmsted, published in Albany and played throughout the Hudson Valley. Many pieces by Francis Hopkinson, dedicated to George Washington, his dear friend. Hopkinson was considered, uh, next to Franklin, one of the most influential men in the colonies. How do people get money to you? Just well, you oh. people are watching you on Kickstart yeah. now. Okay. So, so what do uh, they do? You you'll see 
what the different levels of contributions are okay. on the side right. and what perks we offer. Okay. Any contribution is appreciated. Um, and no matter what you contribute, even if it's $25 or if you want to contribute $5,000, you'll always be listed in our program with our thanks. Please visit our webpage, which is www.museearlymusic.com. Dot org. Thank you so much for your support. We're really happy to make this music for you. Mm -hmm.